Even we can have a Colombian soda. Yes. How is that? Orlando Tabon, a native of Colombia, is an integral part of this community. Colombia, Colombia. He helps Latin American immigrants make the transition to this country, finding them jobs, homes, and more. So which one is your favorite flavor? Uh, I, I, I like both. <laughs> Tonight, we'll get a chance to meet Tabon, known as the mayor of Little Colombia. And I'm trying to help my people and I'm happy. Yeah! On June 30th, MTV will launch Logo, an entire network geared to lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender audiences. It is the wave of where we are in television now. Everybody has to have an, their own channel. I mean, the fact that we have a golf channel is, to me, the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. And yet there are people who are obsessed with golf. Who is really going to be watching and what type of programming will they be running? If you are driven by what the advertisers want to see, then we all have to be white. And we all have to have the income of Will on Will and Grace. And we all have to have no sex. The New York Times, the Daily News, they cannot cover India, uh, Little India. They cannot cover Haiti. They cannot cover Jamaica. They cannot cover um, Italy. I mean, they can't do this. So that's why you need those ethnic media. There are more than 300 ethnic publications in New York City. But on the vast information highway, are ethnic newspapers being forced to the side of the road? Well, you know, when you are a journalist and you work in this huge market as New York, you always have trouble when you are, you know, a minority media. And that's unconstitutional. The government cannot discriminate. The police cannot discriminate uh, between ethnic or mainstream press. They can't discriminate between publications based on size. Yoga is one of the oldest forms of healing therapy. It's my church. It's my therapist and it's my gym all in one. But now, there is a modern twist on an ancient tradition. Try to touch the wall, look back, lean back, fall back, all the way back. This new yoga is done for 90 minutes at a regulated pace in a room that is heated at over 105 degrees. This type of activity maybe demands a little bit more on, on the human body than a normal session of yoga. And I think the education needs to be there as far as the risks that may be increased during this type of activity in this type of environment. I'm Latanya Bowman. I'm Orit Bosworth. I'm Christina Haley. I'm Jennifer Dumont. Those stories tonight on a special City University of New York edition of 60 Minutes.